Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today is International Sandwich Sunday and we are headed to the Cook Islands for some Meeting House Sandwiches. Now, someone sent me this video from um, Hangry Bites underscore on TikTok a while back and uh, they sound pretty good to me, so let's give it a go. All right, so here is hard boiled eggs that have been shredded on a cheese grater. She said that she knows she's supposed to make them uh, by mashing them with a fork, but cannot stop, will not stop. So uh, yeah, we've got shredded hard boiled eggs to which we add mayonnaise. Then she says to use chives or spring onions. I'm using chives. A little salt, get it mixed together, and white pepper. Let me set that aside. Now to canned tuna that was packed in olive oil, we add in really finely diced onions, and we add mayonnaise, sprinkle of salt, and get that mixed together, and add more mayo if it looks dry. And yeah, I'm doing half sandwiches, so I gotta have one half of one, one half of the other, and I got a complete sandwich. So we put down some lettuce on buttered bread, buttered white bread, and on one we add our tuna mixture, I think she put it on the bread. That's my bad. And the other, the egg mixture. Okay, let's give the Meeting House sandwich with the egg salad a go. I like the chives in there. Nice little oniony bite. But the white pepper really plays nicely with the um, eggs and the chives and the mayonnaise. Mmm. Let's give the Meeting House sandwich with tuna in it a go. I mean, that's pretty good. Onion, mayo, a little bit of salt, tuna. You got the richness of the mayo. You've already got a little bit of richness with the tuna. This is pretty good. I do want to plus up the tuna version. I'm going to add some capers. Give it a nice pickly pop. Okay, let's give the Meeting House sandwich that has tuna in it plussed up with capers a go. Now we've got a little brightness in there to go with the richness of mayonnaise. Counteract the sharpness of the onions. Mmm. And just a nice little pop of flavor. Okay, so the Meeting House sandwich with the egg salad I didn't really feel compelled to plus it up. I thought it was delicious as it was with the white pepper, with the chives and the mayonnaise. I think, I think that's probably like, as egg salads go, eight and a half, nine. The Meeting House sandwich that featured the tuna did feel like it needed a little something something. I think the original would be about a seven and a half, plus up with the capers, eight and a half. Both are delicious. I'm gonna finish both of them and I would make the plus up version of the tuna or the just regular version of the egg salad again in a hot minute. All right, see you tomorrow. I'm walking down the hallway, heading into the dining room, and on camera now, 